How's everyone doing today? This is Dad Learning Coins. We're going to just do another little video. So, before we get into it, if you could subscribe, like, and hit that notification button, I'd greatly appreciate it. Now, let's get into the video. So, this is another set of still at same wheat pennies. I'm doing 1940s now. You got 40s, 41s, 2s, all the way to 49. The reason there's three sets, P, D, and S mints. Out of those two bags, I got all of the 40s except for 48S. But I've already had them too. So, because I don't really need any for my book, I will go through, change some out. Let's see here. Like my 43s, I can use some different ones. Some of these I could probably change out. Let's see. Yeah, that would be just that one. So, these. So, I don't need any for my book. But, we will go through and look to see what we can find. Hopefully we can find Double Die, Repunch Mint Mark, something. Maybe not. Who knows? I like Wheat Sense so. So, it don't really matter to me either way. It'd just be cool. The site we're going to use today is going to be coppercoins.com. Yeah, I know you've seen this before on my videos before. So, that's just what I'm going to use. Let's see. We'll start with 1940. We'll just go with the Philadelphia. Let's see here. See if they're... What are we looking for? They have... Let's see... 16. Let's see, you got the 94. So that's going to be a little thicker. Now he's extra thickness. I won't look for that because I can never tell. Because these are worn. Let's see. Those, I don't know if we're going to be able to see much of at all. Those don't look too promising to me, like I'd even notice. Let's see, this is on the date and liberty. Let's see what that looks like. Oh, by the way, you can click on these, what's highlighted like blue or whatever. And I'll take you to another page showing you more pictures. So. So, but I'll just stick here. I guess we can look at the date and stuff real quick. But these are some I probably wouldn't look at very, very much. So, what I'll do, I'll then go through all of them. Starting at the 40s to 49. And if I find some, I'll pop back in. If not, I'll pop back in here in a little while and show you what I found or didn't find. Alrighty. Real quick. Yeah, I'm still on the 40s. It's not a double die, but what I did find is a lamination. If you look on the side, right in here. Lamination goes all the way up to the T. And I think a little bit on the other side by the Y. So. Uh, it's a nice little lamination error. So that one I'll put back with the other ones. So I just want to pop back on and show you that real quick. Now, keep looking for some more. Alrighty. Well, this one. I don't know if it's an RPM or not. I gotta do a little bit more research. But if you look at the S, if I quit moving it right in here, and here it just looks different from the rest. And there are a lot of 1949S RPMs. So this one. I will have to take 
and do some more research on this one. But for now, I'm going to put it with the other coins I found throughout this little thing, which ain't very many between both bags, but one is more than none. So, I'll get back at it. All right. So, all I got left, which I haven't found nothing really, but all I got left are my 1943 still pennies. So I figured, eh, since we're at the end, we'll do them all together. So I'll go here, we're gonna do the, uh, we'll do the Phillies first. And just see what we can see. I haven't been having good luck with these, so we'll just go through them pretty quickly. Most of them are damaged, rust, a little rusty, and. And it's common for still pennies. But either way, I like them. I like most coins, so. I don't see nothing really that stands out. There are some pretty ones in here. And yeah, I'm just looking at the, the obverse. Seems anything I'm looking for will mostly be on the obverse. So. Not seeing too much of anything. But sometimes you win some, sometimes you lose. And so far, this is looking like a losing session. But I did get a lot of nice wheat pennies. And I can switch out my still ones in my book. I mean, it's raining outside pretty good. So, let's see here. It's a nice plain looking one. That looks a little weird right there, the four. One, this coin's a little too shiny. I wonder if it's been plated. And then that four is like, it's just different. It's back look like, all the back. I wonder if this is plated. Let's see, I'm gonna switch back to the camera. I hope that's the wrong one. Let's see, what do you guys think? The way this looks.
Might not be. But I do like how that floor is kind of like hiding. So I'm gonna set that one aside too. Just because. And that was the last one of the, the Phillies. So now let's look at the San Francisco's. And these ain't looking very good either. Nothing much going on here. Hmm. Well. Last one. Not seeing a whole lot. So, let's see. So that's all I went through today. Didn't find much out of all of those. Actually from the teens through the 40s. I've only got couple pennies I found which we'll go through them again another time stick these back aside so that will probably do it for me today so remember if you would wouldn't mind subscribe like and hit that notification buttons I'd appreciate it and remember always have fun hunting thank you